Welcome back to Backyard Football. Back to the back, back, back. So this is your first time being a home team. Yeah, it is. Exciting. Yeah. Oh, man. We're playing the Cleveland Browns. The Browns. The greatest team in the NFL. If you don't know the NFL, the Browns are the worst team. They're 0-9. They have yet to win a game. Yeah. Sure. Apologies to my Browns fans out there. Hey, they... The Cavaliers, their basketball team, won a championship this year. The Their baseball team was one game away. From winning the World Series. So... Football's not your sport, Cleveland. Uh, yeah, you at got, least, you got some at least they stuff. have something. Yeah, you got some good stuff going on. Some some people, some cities got nothing. Oh, yeah. There are some cities where... You smashed me. Their best sport is chess. <laughs> or, in the case of... Chess isn't a sport. What is it, South Korea? Their national sport is... Fuck. League of Legends? Yeah. That's so crazy to me. That's pretty cool. It is pretty cool. As long as it's only that country. When it starts getting to be that a ton of countries are doing it, it's like, okay. Yeah. I mean, eSports is cool. I love eSports. I watch it all the time. But the difference between that and, like, a super physical sport, it just, it makes sense. Oh, there's Jerry Rice. It's your boy Jerry Rice. Aren't you on? You're on hard mode. You're sure. Yes, I'm you're on hard mode. You're on the mode. hardest difficulty. Yes. This is ridiculous, dude. Look, I'm too good. If backyard, I'll give it to you. You're good at this game. That's if for sure. backyard football was the the next esport, then backyard football, <laughs> I'd be cashing in. It'd be awesome. Yeah. So it's um it's the day after the election. We're yeah, that. Voting. Yeah, that happened. The United States election. Yeah. Should clarify if you're not I mean, in the United we, States. I mean, but the, I mean, they know that we're. Yeah, we we're we're the American. US. We live in the U.S. Pretty pretty crazy election. Yeah. Super close. Yep. Doesn't doesn't happen like that often. No. I was like, I'm just gonna go to bed, and then the election was so close and interesting. And I watched like most of it, surprisingly. Wish I had a special. Yeah, a special play would be nice here. Oh gosh, oh gosh, that guy's wide open over there. Oh, they threw it to another one. He <laughs> dropped it. All right. But uh, back to esports. If you, oh, they faked. They faked again. Wow. They be faking. I don't remember them faking all the time like this. Um, if there was a game. For esports that you could compete in, what would you want to compete in? Oh, there aren't many games that are like big in esports. What you mean, like if it was one that one that, that one that exists? Um, and then if there is a game you wanted to exist, what would you want it to be? I can't believe I'm saying this. Probably the league. You be you the one league. Play. It's got the most money in it. It's got yeah. There's a lot of money involved. They get I, a lot of exposure. Yeah, I I just think it's it's pretty cool. Yeah, and you've you've played League of Legends a little yeah. bit. Yeah, I'm not very good. I played I played for like most of the summer just because my friends were playing, yeah. and I wanted you know I wanted to play games with them. So we we uh, get on Skype, and we um like we'd be on call and we'd talk about it, communicate all that stuff, and it was really fun. Love love games where I play with my friends. It's yeah, perfect. Um, don't don't play anymore. They fake this too. Whoa, whoa! They're pulling a me, man. They're, They're faking fake. every time. That's crazy. Oh, I thought they were going for two. I was like, what? That would have been crazy if they went for two. That you can. I forgot that you could. But yeah, you can. But yeah, and then if there was if there was one that's not that I could include, um, maybe, maybe Destiny, is Overwatch an esport? It has it has a, like the, hmm, it's tough to say because it has a league, but it's run by Blizzard. Yeah, it's not run by so like not really. MLG or anything. Oh no. Yeah. So yeah, I'd say one of one of those two. Yeah. Um, yeah. 
For me, I'm a. Oh. Sonic Boom! Jeez, oh, that dude's fast. Yeah. I'm a big, uh. For those of you who don't know, I'm a pretty big fighting game guy. But I'm not very good at any fighting games. So, <laughs> I'd like to be good at a fighting game. I think that would be. That'd be fun. Like, Street Fighter V. Or something like that. Far, scrambling it up. And if I could pick one game to be a beast. <gasps> Whoa. I was horrified that the guy <laughs> sprung over. Yeah. I'd want uh, Super Monkey Ball to be a <laughs> Super Monkey Ball. I'd be a pro Super Monkey Ball player. <laughs> I think if That's you... not true. I've seen speedruns of Super yeah. Monkey Ball. Holy shit. If you've never seen a speedrun of a game, I recommend looking up a speedrun of Super Monkey Ball. It's, it's so it's insane. Nice. Like if you if you thought that Nick was good at that game, when Nick is not bad at Super Monkey Ball, he's pretty good. But it's crazy. Like there's people that are yeah, way so better. Good. That you can just whip yeah. through stuff. Mm -hmm. Just speedrunning in general is super cool to me. Yeah, it's impressive. Yeah. Oh, the funny. ones where I really like in um, they're either gonna hocus hocus pocus or yeah. Just in there. There's a um, um, looks like hocus pocus. Yep, yep. There he is. He didn't throw it to him, but it worked actually. So, in like in Super Mario World, there's a very intricate glitch, and usually I don't like glitched speed runs. I just think they're not as interesting as someone just going through the actual game as fast as they possibly can. But glitched runs can be cool if the glitch is like super hard to do and super intricate, like in Su Super Mario World. Like, it's, it's like, frame-specific. They have to hit a certain button at, like, literally within a sixtieth of a second. And it's, it's insane. Pretty impressive. Whoa. No. Oh. Get tackled, bitch. Mmm. Uh, fuck, fuck. <laughs> oh, man. No. Oh, good job, Dimitri. Did he, he didn't get it. Uh, oh gosh! Don't fake it again, please. We'll see. I'm gonna try to sit nope, back. Okay. It'll be really funny if the Browns give you my toughest fight. <laughs> <laughs> After we were like, Browns, Browns worst team in the NFL. Well, they they are. Yeah. Now. Yeah. I don't. Were they ever like a Not contender? Really. Not really. Oh my gosh! That it's so big, but he's so fast. Yeah. All right, I got six seconds. Yeah. And I don't know much about basketball history because I'm a Bucks fan. And the Bucks haven't like really ever been good. But uh, is that it? Dang it. Have has have like the Cavaliers always been? No, no, no. They were only, never. Only good. More they were never good before LeBron. Really. LeBron. I mean, I figured, but they've got some other good players, right? No. Cleveland. Yeah. Yeah. Kyrie Irving's good. Kevin Love's good. J.R. Smith is good sometimes. Um. Yeah, in terms of, cause the, the at least for the Browns, they didn't have a team for a while, right? Um, and then when the, what were they? Oh shoot, is that my fault? They were the. I'm trying to think of it, cause all all like the switches, um, cause the, they used to be the, it used to be the Baltimore, the Baltimore Colts, and then the Colts moved to Indy, Indy. and then Baltimore didn't have a team. And then they moved to the Raven. They ended up moving to Baltimore in the '90s. And then I think the 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 Ravens like went to the Browns. And then oh god, he's wide open. Uh oh, there, there's I I don't remember exactly how it goes, but there was a bunch of shifting up, and the, the Browns came out of that. They ended up being a team. Okay. So they're they're still pretty young. They're one of the younger teams. Yeah. As opposed to, like, your Packers, your Bears, um, your Cardinals have been around for a long time. Even though the Cardinals used to be in Chicago. Yeah. And then they moved. I never got that. To Arizona. Moving team stuff. Well, it just happened this year. Oh, that's St. right. St. Louis Rams moved to um, Los Angeles. I forgot about that. Mm -hmm. Which they they moved back there. They used they used to right. be the Los Angeles Rams. Oh, so close! And then they switched it up. I have a special. I think I'll need it. Now. 
Oh. Yeah, you're, you're really close. You just do See that. what they are. Oh, yeah. I don't need that. You just do that shotgun play. And the pile driver. Is Brett Favre time, baby? You made it. <laughs> yeah, Brett Favre. Kick that extra point. Ricky. All right. What a kick. Yeah, the Browns are giving me the biggest <laughs> fight. Yeah. Wow. Who would have thought? Get him, Ricky. Yeah. Got him. Got him. Hey. Got him. Oh man. Yeah, if you're if you're um, a viewer that's not in the U.S. because we on the channel we can like see where viewers yeah. are, um, like if they're in the U.S. or if they're yeah. in New Zealand any country any country but um there most are most are u.s most are US. i don't remember the exact yeah. number it's like i think in the 70s or 80s percent yeah. of u.s but there are people that are viewing outside the country yeah i the one that's surprised i think i saw chile okay we had like a viewer from chile and i thought that was crazy yeah so shout out to a viewer if you're not from the u.s yeah let us know how your country's doing yeah. post in the comments other countries' governments are interesting. Yeah. Because I kind of, like, know how America works now. I want to see, like... I like seeing, like, what's different. Yeah. And stuff. Oh, no. I should have been him. Like, I took a... Oof. I took a German class in high school and learning about German government was super cool. But, I mean, all they ever talked about is Hitler. Yeah. In, in the U.S. Yeah, it was in... It's unfortunate that that's yeah. that's one of the things that you remember from. Huh? Yeah, it's crazy what one person can do. Yeah, because right now your country is doing pretty good. If you're from Germany, uh, viewers, I'm asking you this question: If you're from Germany, I don't know if we've ever had a German viewer before. Yeah. But know. if you're from Germany, and you're watching this. Post in the comments and tell us: um, Do you learn a lot about Hitler? in like your schools or is it more like you learn about other sides of the war i bet they learn about both I mean, I, yeah. i've heard that in Ger like they're kind they're ashamed for well, the yeah. most part like oh, you yeah. don't talk about it when you're in germany oh yeah that's something we learned too because I, I went to germany and my teacher was like there are some pretty serious rules you don't talk about hitler yeah like, even as a joke, you just don't talk about it. Yeah. And that makes sense. Yeah, totally. Because it's something that's so they painful don't... for a lot of people. Yeah. Pablo! Oh, jeez. There you go. Yes! And then... Yes! There we go. The rule that I thought was the most interesting about our trip, uh, our teacher was like, I want you to dress in more typical uh, German clothing so that people would... Um, try to speak German to us instead of trying to speak English. But most people could still tell that we were American. <laughs> and we're like... Yeah. Cause I mean, when you're in a country that you're not from, you tend to stick, you out. stick out. Like, if yeah. you're if you're a tourist. Mm -hmm. You know? Yeah. You're the only people with backpacks on, usually. <laughs> it's different in the U.S. because we're such a melting pot. We have yeah, so many people yeah. from so many places. It's tough so to I'm, I'm never surprised when I see anybody, mm -hmm. you know? It's like, oh yeah, they're... They're from South America, they're from Asia, they're from yeah. Europe. It's like, yeah. Yeah, people, America's got a lot of tourist stuff. Especially if you're in other tourist cities. Like, yeah. Like if you're in, say, New York, there's tons of tourists all the time. Bomb ball! And you recovered it. Oh, yes. <laughs> That's going to do it. Yeah, that'll do it. Can you you can tell that Brett Favre has a southern twang. Oh, I could. Like when, when he calls it out, they actually have a twang. Because Brett Favre is from Mississippi, yeah. so he's got that southern voice. Mississippi. Oh, Three. Kick it off. Get it off. Oh. Have you ever been to a foreign country? Canada. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, we've been to Canada. That's right. I forgot we went to Canada together. Yeah. 
with our marching band. Yeah. Good times, good times. Yeah, those were. That was a really fun trip. There you have it. 35 to 20 is your final. 35 to 20. It was kind of a fight that time. Yeah. We're going in. We're going to go straight into the next game. And you'll see that in the next episode. Week 5.